morning guys i promised i will show you what i bought from like souvenir shop i really like the design i don't know if you know but i collect postcards but very nice design postcards from every every place i go so we've got power sculpture my favorite person marie curie skłodowska and some bookmarks and the best thing is this <laughs> you saw my socks yesterday, destroyed them, and I've got socks with power sculpture. Isn't that nice? Ah, and I almost forgot the canvas bag, which is pretty cool. It's day two in Warsaw. As I promised, I will do you the apartment tour because it's quite interesting over here. Uh, let me start maybe with the entrance. You see, the apartment is not big, but I think for one person, or for two people it's quite enough. This is the entrance. We've got the crazy, crazy mirror over here. Look at that. And look at my t-shirt. Uh, bathroom is small, but it's a lot of mirrors here, so it looks bigger. Oh, it's comfortable, you know. Blue. Yeah, each single detail is like designed here. And of course we've got a shower. So, ah, this is interesting, sorry. Look at this. <laughs> very, very small kitchen, but uh, who would be cooking now? You know, this, this microwave, my bananas, water, and small fridge all this important the dishwasher and of course mirrors they know that mirrors make the interior look bigger so they put it and this is this kind of main room and this is what I like the most because look at all the decoration table with my mess on it okay this is a little bit tacky but well it works well somehow also the interior is quite high and I don't know if you see this this is gold <laughs> okay this is the wardrobe look at me and my t-shirt t-shirts nice and look at the shoes And here, that wasn't really comfortable to sleep on. I tried to unfold it, but I didn't manage. So just imagine. And here we've got all kinds of pictures. And this is quite special. I, I don't know, it's a bit tacky, but nice. Look at sofa, of course. Uh, we've got these chairs that are quite nice. Okay, so this is my mess, but you know, chairs like that. And the table this way. like coffee table book with ornaments ah, i don't know i was studying from this kind of book when i was in the high school so and who is that of course the tv is everywhere yeah they really made it look bigger you know with all of this tapestry and stuff and we've got the balcony oh, maybe let's go out You see there? This is the National Stadium. There, I think we're gonna go there now. I found this apartment in a booking.com. I always do booking.com because you know, if you refer the friend, you've got the cash back and stuff like that. And for me, it's just hassle free. And I prefer staying in apartments rather than hotels. I think I already told you every time I travel somewhere, I rent the apartment. So you can go back to my previous videos. I will leave you the link down below with the apartment tour from Krakow and the apartment tour from Wrocław. I paid for one night 180 slots as far as, far as I remember and uh, here you will see how much is it in uh, dollars, euros, uh, pounds and stuff like that uh, it's very close to Nowy Świat uh, Avenue it's literally one minute walking 
and one minute walking from Chopin Museum. Okay guys, I'm all packed, I'm all prepared, time to leave this apartment and I feel so sorry because I felt very comfortable here. But let's go out because we cannot stay all the day at home. I woke up like 7 a.m. and it was very gray and like the weather was quite nasty. Uh, but at the moment I see it's not bad, it's sunny, it's gonna be colder than yesterday, but it's not gonna be raining, so we can go to the park and we can walk around there. So I think I will see you outside. Hello guys, we are in front of the National Stadium. It's like, I don't know where am I? The thing was, I was walking on this kind of like highway street, the expressway, and it was, I swear, like 200 policemen and I was like, oops, something's going to happen and I don't know what, so I don't know if I choose the good day to come here but you can see it from here I think it would be better to look at it at night but well, we've got what we've got I will just walk around it and we're gonna go further The National Stadium in Warsaw was first opened in 2012 and can fit over 56,000 of people. It's used mostly for the football matches, but it's also a great place for concerts of the biggest music stars. And this is the famous Warsaw palm tree. I started my walk in Washington Park from this beautiful building called Palace on the Water or Palace on the Isle. This is one of my most favorite places in Warsaw and as you can see it looks beautiful during the autumn. The palace itself was built in a neoclassical style in the end of 17th century. Originally it was a bathhouse but eventually it was converted into a residence in the late 18th century after being bought by Stanisław August Poniatowski who made it his summer residence. We should really feel lucky as this place could have been destroyed during the Second World War. Occupying Germans drilled holes in the palace walls in preparation for blowing it up. Thankfully, they never succeeded. So as you can see, we are in Łazienki in Warsaw now. <laughs> what happened to my face was, I don't know if you have it as well, but if the sun is very strong or there is a wind, you are basically just crying. And so all my face is a mess, I'm sorry. Uh, this is the beautiful place. Now you can imagine living in Warsaw and being so close to this place. You can just walk around here. Look, a peacock. Okay, let's talk about squirrels. You see the Polish ones are like ginger, while in London all the squirrels were like grey. Łazienki Park, or as it's called in English, Buffs Park or Royal Buffs, is the largest park in Warsaw. It's a great place to have a walk all the year round. In spring and summer, the park is an explosion of life. Squirrels, peacocks, ducks and swans are only few species you can see here. Every Sunday at midday there is a free classical music concert. I came here on autumn, so I missed that. But still, the colors and the vibe was just amazing. look at this I want to be there so badly This is the old orangery building. It was built to house exotic trees in the winter season. 
It's also a place which is very closely linked to art and culture as its gallery has Stanisław August's collection of sculptures. It was also amazing to sit down in the small cafe located next to it and have a cup of coffee and rest a bit after this quite a long walk. Okay, we are in front of Chopin Monument. It's very beautiful. In the summer people sit here and they listen to the music. There are concerts here. We didn't enter the Orangerie because I saw what time is it and well I'm in a hurry. I walked too much around this Wazienki. What can I tell you? Let's go to the center, eat something and we have to leave Warsaw till December I reckon. I'm so sorry but time flies so fast in here. Let's go. I left the park and made my way to the center where I found this vegan place called Vegeguru. The concept is quite nice as you sit on the pillows, not on the chair. I ordered the bowl of the day and as you can see it looked yummy as well as a cup of matcha. I'd really recommend this place to all the vegan people traveling to Warsaw. Hello guys, I don't know if you hear me well. I'm in the central train station in Warsaw and I'm going home. It will be approximately two hours and a half. I bought a ticket for the first class so we'll see how it goes and I hope it will be no delays today. So let's say bye bye to or so even though it's hard and hopefully we're gonna come back soon. That's all for today guys. I hope you enjoyed walking around Warsaw with me. It's not my last video from there though. I'm pretty delayed with uploading so the next one will be also from here but from December. If you don't wanna miss it please subscribe to my channel. Don't forget to give this video a thumb up and leave a comment saying what was your favorite place from this trip? Don't forget you can also visit me on my social media, Twitter, Facebook and Instagram. I hope to see you next time. Bye bye!